This is why the quarterback tush-push sneak has not been banned by the NFL competition committee. It's because it doesn't always work every single play. So you'll see right here that the New York Giants have the ball. It's fourth down and one from the Seattle 27 and a half yard line or 26 and a half yard line. And you see that they're clearly in position for the tush-push. We've got three guys in the backfield. Daniel Jones obviously in position to sneak it. The Giants tried to sneak up and quick snap this on the Seahawks, but they were clearly prepared for it. I want you to watch the two linebackers right here, Bobby Wagner and Jordan Brooks. They do a phenomenal job getting there, especially Bobby Wagner, man. He stonewalls Daniel Jones. That's pretty evident right there that this does not work every single time you try it, man. You have to have a quarterback who basically squats however many hundred pounds that Jalen Hurts squats in order for this play to be successful all the time. We've seen plenty of other teams try to run this play the exact same way that the Philadelphia Eagles do. And the only team that I think that really is able to pull it off is Anthony Richardson and the Colts because he also has a big frame and probably squats a crap ton as well. So at the end of the day, man, you have to have the right personnel in order for this play to be consistently effective. And that is why it will not be banned by the NFL competition committee, no matter how much complaining happens, because at the end of the day, just like it's been shown here, it doesn't always work.